So for this one, we're going to have a little look at um, the side to side movement in the spine. So for this one, place your legs just a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. Um, and you're just going to soften your weight into that front leg. And we're going to have the left leg forwards for this, but use whichever leg we decided when we did our assessment. Now, as you do that, the back leg stays straight and you might feel that heel just start to lift up a little bit. That's awesome. You're gonna keep everything on top of each other, like we said before with the cogs, so nothing's starting to move out of the plane of motion that we're working on. And then, just like we did when we're standing, we're gonna to start to put the side-to-side -side motion on. So, we'll start with a reach down to the side. And on this one, as I let my weight come forwards, I can reach across the body. My hips move slightly to the left, and my torso moves slightly to the right. At the same time, just try and keep your head level. So you're not going to let your head drop, keep looking straight ahead. The other way we tried it was by taking the left hand over the top. So again, as we move forward into that left leg, you can just reach out. Now top tip for breathing with this one, I want you to breathe out as you come forward. So breathe out, and back, breathe out. 